The Chelsea Painters is a group limited to 25 artists. We are in all media and we gather once a week, every Tuesday, and we paint together, we do various activities together, and it has been an organization of over 50 years. We decided that we wanted to let our artists do their thing, and we are varied. We have watercolorists, we have oil painters, acrylic, pastels, mixed media, and because we are varied, we decided we wanted to show that variety, that everyone is skilled in their own area, and that a group of people who do all different media can actually have a great deal of fun together and learn from each other. Sometimes people do a uh, demonstration. This is a special technique. So we pick up little tidbits from one another and we pick up major things. We have an artist who uses watercolor in an unusual way and she'll call us over to take a look at what she's doing so we understand how she gets to her end product. We also have artists who do landscapes or figure drawing or still lifes, uh, water scenes, and so we are all experimenting with different subject matter, with different materials, and it's a fascinating thing to watch. We always learn from one another. We're telling stories. Each and every one of us tells a story. How we feel on this particular day, how that subject makes us feel, it doesn't have to be uh, earth-shattering reason, it can just be something that strikes us. So I look at it as storytellers, artists are storytellers. I also think we're historians. I have painted any number of barns that no longer exist. So I feel, okay, I'm a historian. The only way that still exists is because I painted it. So it's a multifaceted and fulfilling thing to be an artist. It's therapeutic. Art is in everything. It has to do with the respect that we have for every person's gifts. Everyone has something that they can do, and it doesn't matter whether it's writing or being an architect or an engineer or a street sweeper. We can all value what other people do, and if you value it, it's fulfilling to the person. I think artists solve the world's problems. When you are already thinking with a creative mind, okay, creative in any fathom that you want to talk about, that's how we solve problems. That's how we make innovative discoveries. Life gets a little rough, life gets interesting, there's joy, there's sadness, there's all these things. As a very personal story, when my mother died, the person at Arbor Hospice said, did I know how lucky I was to be an artist? And I said, yes, I do. As my mother was dying, she told me never stop painting. So I think that is the case with absolutely any person, is that it offers them freedom and a therapy and the creativity that they need to do whatever it is they have to do in the rest of their life. I consider everything to be a creative endeavor, let me put it that way. Chelsea Painters is most honored to be here at the theater because this is a lovely venue and we hope that it is a, a great experience for people to see the variety that 21 people can have in their art and be of one mind to support one another as we go along through life.